Kathy said, you're going to hell. I said, I like hell. <laughs> Mama said, that boy don't know what he's talking about. No, I didn't know what I was talking about because I was blind. But I certainly, every Christian I saw, I certainly didn't want to be like them. <laughs> My mama said, now, Jesse, you don't mess around with them girls in that church. You understand? I said, Mama, I promise you, I will never be with any of them sweat hogs. I ain't going to be in there. <laughs> My mama, why, you don't think they're pretty? I said, Mama, have you seen them? I said, they don't wear makeup. I said, there can't be no lust. How can lust ever be birthed in that place to start with? <laughs> I said, now they go over to the Philistines where Delilah is. That's at the house of a different color. My grandmother used to want me to date the girls in the church. She, she was four foot nine. I loved it. She's sweet. She said, she said, I love you, grandson. And I'm looking down at her. Can you imagine me looking down at someone? <laughs> Then why don't you, you need to marry one of the girls in the church? I said, Grandma, I'm going amongst the Philistines. <laughs> she said, they're going to cut your hair off and make you blind. <laughs> she's thinking, like, they're going to kill you, they're going to kill you. I said, that's okay. That's okay. And I brought home a girl one time. My mama was so rude. I can say that because she's dead now. But I'll tell you what, my, my mama was rude to people, man. Rude to girls I brought her. Because I kind of like a little greasy girl, you know, when I, when I, I just say, hey, what's up, mama, what you doing? Come on, you know. I mean, I was a rock entertainer, you know, I mean, I dated cocktail waitresses, you name it, we did it. So I brought this girl in, I, mean, I thought she looked pretty fine, you know. I, I, said, I said, listen, I'm going to stop my house, get a couple of bucks, and she said, well, I'll go in. I said, no, you don't want to go in, you don't want to She said, well, why not, you don't want nobody to see me? I said, yeah, I don't mind. I said, you, you don't know my mama. She said, what's wrong with your mama? I said, she said, she said, from what? I said, I don't know. <laughs> I don't know what she said from. But she's into this same stuff. This girl ain't never heard nothing. This girl walk in, you know, she's a little greasy, real, real tight skirt. You know, tight, man, I mean, you know. <laughs> I walk in there. I say, hey, mama, I said, uh, this is, and I named the girl, protect protector, innocence. <laughs> she didn't have any innocence, but I was protecting her. <laughs> so I didn't have any neither. I said, Mama, this is so so. She said, she looked like a Jezebel to me, you little Jezebel. Now, this girl didn't know nothing about God. She said, who's Jezebel? I said, that's a very nice person we know that lived down the street. <laughs> she lived down the street, really like her a lot. I said, come on, let's get out of here, girl. Girl never knew Mama called her Jezebel. I said, what's the matter with you? She said, no, no, what's the matter with you? <laughs> She's so greasy, she fall down, she slide to the North Pole. Then I met Kathy at a swimming pool. That's when I had a six pack. Now I got a keg, but I had a six pack in those days. <laughs> and Kathy went, woo, look at this boy. I said, what's up, mama, how you doing? And I took Kathy to the house one time. She said, you want me to go in? Uh, I said, let me tell you something about my mom. She said, Kathy said, from what? I said, I don't know. Uh, what well, we got to lose? She don't know nothing about God. And mama liable to call her Ahab, who knows, I don't know. But Kathy looked real, mama looks at her, I said, mom, I said, this is Kathy. She says, Kathy. She said, Jesse, that's going to be your wife. I said, control yourself, mama. I ain't talking about marrying nobody, I just want to get to know the girl. <laughs> to tell you the truth, I think I like her sister better. I dated her sister. I was a heathen, I'd have dated a mama, but I was crazy them days. I was nuts, you understand? I was just a sinful man. I ain't gonna lie about it, I was full of sin. I was 19 years old, went out with a 55 year old woman. They said, who's that? I said, that's the one I caught. I didn't care, it didn't make no deal. I was crazy in them days. She said, that's gonna be your wife. I said, mom, I mean, what's the matter with you? She said, the Lord done spoke it to me. I don't wanna talk to you, fool. You're nothing but a fool. The Lord done spoke it to me. Don't fight this thing, Jesse. I said, whoa, mama, that ain't gonna happen. She said, I'm telling you, the Lord spoke it to me. That's a good girl. I said, mama, she don't know nothing about God. She said, she will. I said, don't you infect her, mama. <laughs> Stay away from her. Sure enough, man. Kathy come over there, mama start talking to her about God. And Kathy was interested. I said, you don't wanna talk about that. You don't wanna talk about that, come on. Whoa, 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 what is all this? I said, you're Catholic, you're Catholic. Yeah, I'm Catholic, but what, what? I never heard that before. She had never read the Bible. Mama said, I'll buy you a Bible. 
Oh, you don't want to give him your own Bible, Bible? Give a Bible? I said, if you give you one, look at the pictures. That's what I do with Playboy. I just look at the pictures. <laughs> Kathy started reading the Bible and got born again. Got saved in Minneapolis, Minnesota. I'm doing a show for the Minnesota Vikings, the Purple Gang, 1970. What, one, two, whatever it was. And she says, is that little heathen with you? I said, Kathy said, yeah. She's talking to my mom. She said, put the heathen on the phone. I said, what? We're going to get you. Yeah, we're going to get you. We're going to get you. <laughs> and then, of course, I did come to the knowledge of Jesus. And before my mother went home to be with the Lord, she saw me preach the gospel. She saw Kathy praising God, speaking in tongues. And she even saw Jody like this. And she's a little girl just praising the Lord. Give the Lord a hand clap.